Hey guys, in this video we are going to play a lot of top ladder on our road to get 8000 trophies in Clash Royale. Currently right now we are number 21 in the world and yes, maybe we can get top 10 in the world in this video. Alright guys, we are now in the first game. He is playing the Fire Spirit. I'm answering with my own Mega Minion. So feel free to also subscribe to the channel. Also maybe you want to drop a like down below. And now we are playing against, yes, it looks like Hawk Rider. So we are starting instantly with the Mighty Miner. Mighty Miner is just a good card against him. So you guys can see Mighty Miner is just insanely good compared to the Valkyrie, especially against the Hawk Rider. So now He's answering for skeletons, also skeletons are just insanely good against my Mighty Miner, but it's okay, my Mighty Miner did a great job already, so he doesn't have to do more. Mega Minion is getting in, I'm playing uh, yeah, Mega Minion onto the Ice Golem, and it looks like, yes, unfortunate, he is just able to cycle back to his next Musketeer, so it's so, so hard playing against 2.6, guys, even if you are playing with the Mighty Miner, it's doesn't feel right it just it doesn't feel like you can get some damage tombstone is also just getting in great fireball by my side to be honest it's not impossible uh, it's it's not impossible defending the musketeer with the skeleton drags so i had to play my fireball unfortunate and now we are in a small elixir lead it just feels like a small elixir lead at least lava hound is getting in and now let's see where his next musketeer is coming but for sure we also have to keep in mind that we are not having a fireball in the hand so yeah my, maybe they are coming to musketeers back in the game and in case that it's kind of loose to be honest okay the are getting in against his musketeer so when I'm zapping right now, he could fail his fireball. Is he failing his fireball? No, it, it, it's, it doesn't look like that. So Tombstone is getting in. He's playing with the Fire Spirit. So also Fire Spirit is kind of bigger problem for me personally. Um, but it's okay. And I'm still focused. Okay, guys, he's playing with the Earthquake. This is a game changer. This is a game changer. Drakes are getting in against him. He is playing with the earthquake. Wow. So I just can build up a huge push. Didn't you until right now? He is playing with the earthquake. Now my fireball is getting in. Zap is also getting in. Just killing the musketeer with my whole push. Drakes are connected onto the tower. Balloon connected onto the tower for sure. When he is playing with the earthquake, you just can build up an insanely huge push. This time we build it up an insanely huge huge push so we won the first game luckily in this video against for sure a good matchup until i knew he is playing with the earthquake we just can't check fastly how many trophies we got we got 24 trophies this is just insanely much so now we are number yes number 12 in the world okay guys now playing against the next opponent he is doing minor and i was first place so Actually, there is just one deck, to be honest, where the Miner and the Arrows are played in combination. Or, oh, to be honest, it's two decks. It's on the one hand, Lava, Miner, and on the other hand, it's the giant Kamikaze deck. So, now going in completely with my Skelly Drax and also with my Mega Minion. I don't have to zap because we just know he isn't having his cards in the in the hand as well so maybe there's coming something else so my mighty miner is just getting in and yes it looks like i already won fireballing this stuff to be honest is just insanely good i could use the ability right now and i think that's exactly what we are going to do using the ability right now pushing the mighty miner onto the right again zapping the stuff so maybe the left tower is also getting nearly down left tower is also getting nearly down so a great just a great start okay tombstone is getting in i have to take care about his big pushes my drakes are getting in right now so he just failed his arrows it's just a great start but it's a great start to be honest because he just over committed on the offense at the beginning minor plus the arrows were just the over commit completely especially the arrows were just so so bad but i don't care i don't care i take it it's um, yeah, not a free win, but it's kind of decided the game already, to be honest. Now going in with the Lava Hound onto the right. 
for sure he's also having the balloon onto the, in the hand for the uh, to to support his lava hound onto the right. But it's okay. I'm taking that. Mega Minion is getting in. I'm getting in with the balloon. And now I'm getting in with the tombstone, fireballing the whole stuff is that's what I want to see. Also, Balloon is getting pushed completely in the back. Drake is getting in, and you guys can see it's kind of flawless defense against his big push. I'm getting his tower down, so I'm just happy. The, 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 uh, yes, the deck is not, or his deck is not that easy for me personally, but to be honest, also because of the. Um, broken mighty miner in my deck the game was kind of decided after just one big push now zapping this one so i'm not taking oh i'm taking a hit okay this was not the plan this was not what i wanted to see but it doesn't matter still taking him completely down as i said i think i said it two times ago as i said because of his arrows mistake at the beginning doesn't matter nearly taking his him few crowns so all good now let's just check how many trophies we got 21 is insanely good for our range so we climbed back on our season highest let's go that's what i want to see because it's just a small step on getting hopefully yes 8000 trophies as fast as possible so we climbed back to number eight in the world okay guys being in the next game against nexus queen for sure we just need round about 50 or just need round about 50 trophies for number one in the world but you guys know how hard it is actually when being in the top 10 in the world getting even more trophies so yes i think it might be getting kind of hard but now answering with my mega minion mega minion is played high but for sure lava hound will go in front of the valkyrie so valkyrie is just or oh, you're so sad i'm spelling the valkyrie wrong so yes how should i spell the valkyrie well cool i don't know i just i just don't know it so please write me in the comments how should i just spell the valkyrie i really don't know and yes maybe you guys want to tell me how i should do that but to be honest i personally think it doesn't matter because you guys know what i'm trying to tell or you guys know what i'm trying to say and that's the most important thing lava hound is getting in so yes he is using his ability but i'm kind of successful and now I'm just waiting until his next Tesla is coming so I can go in with the Drakes onto the next Tesla. But I think he still needs to cycle at least one more card to the Tesla. I don't know. Mighty Miner is getting in so hopefully Mighty Miner is also tanking for the pups. Okay, he's using the ability or his rocket so... Did I give him value? I don't know to be honest. I, uh, the Mighty Miner failed right but... I just didn't took that much damage onto him, so yes, maybe it was kinda wrong. Zapping the stuff for sure, I'm not taking any kind of damage, but I just need to cycle through. Tombstone is getting in as well again. Tombstone is coming in. Mighty Miner is also coming in at the white. So, next Lava Hound is getting, he is playing his Tesla. I just don't understand his placement about the Tesla. Drakes are getting in. So it's looking kind of good. Balloon is getting in for sure. I'm just giving him a lot of rocket value, but it's still looking like correctly. He can't really, or he can nado back, but when z just zapping the whole stuff, did I? Oh no, I'm not getting a hit. But Mega Mini is connecting kind of, and now we are even more in a damage lead against just a hard, hard matchup. And I think you might agree on to that point okay mighty miner is getting in right now drakes are oh crap i need to zap that i need to zap that zap is coming in so luckily now my lava hound is getting focused uh fireballing this situation is the right mega minion is also coming in hopefully just killing the tesla and the queen but it's kind of looking like that i can't go in with the balloon because a balloon would just be in some kind of value so going in with the next lava hound instantly kind of high so i just can support with the drakes that's what instantly is coming in drakes behind my lava hound he's using the rocket but you guys can see lava hound is just chipping onto him he can't really use the nado 
on activating the king tower. So just zapping the whole stuff. Balloon is walking onto him. He can't finish my balloon. Let's go guys, we won against Expo Queen live in the video. He didn't play that bad, but to be honest, I think I played kind of better. So getting even more trophies. This is just an insanely video already. Let's go guys. So let's just check which number we are right now. We got number four in the world against Expo. Let's go guys. Okay guys, now being in the next game against Titan. Let's see just what Titan is going to play. I'm going to fireball it. I'm going in with the drakes. I just can't completely over commit, I guess, because it's going to be piggies in combination with the barbarian. So it's kind of more important activating King Tower instead of defending his push flawlessly. So it's kind of all good. Mighty Miner is getting in. Also, my ability is now just getting in. Ki don't know if it's kind of smart, but it's looking like that. Mega Million also is just getting in. Zap is coming. So there's no reason for me why this shouldn't be smart. But now using the Mighty Miner to push actually my Mighty Miner onto the right is a great, great play. Now he locked that so I just can go in with the balloon in the offense. He's using the hunter. He's using the firecracker, but luckily his hunter was played out. Now he's having the firecracker in the hand, but it's important to know when playing against a firecracker, you're always getting a hit when the firecracker is just getting two hits onto your balloon. But when he is able to play the firecracker instantly, so firecracker is taking three hits onto your balloon, you can't defend him actually. Okay, Lava Hound is getting in, maybe some barbarians are coming. Okay, piggies are coming, Tombstone is getting in. I have my King Tower activated luckily also. My one skeleton is taking some damage. This is kind of good, but for sure you guys see how many damage we are taking. And to be honest, it looks like it will be the first lose of this video. Even when we are losing, it's totally fine because losing is part of the game. And it's important to know that losing is just part of the game. Mighty Miner is getting in. And now it, it doesn't look like we can take him down. But let's just keep trying out zap is getting in and now my tombstone is coming so hopefully still defending him kinda lava hound is coming but you guys can see the right lane the left lane is just oh also the hunter onto my tower so i just the, the game just doesn't want to give me actually the win drakes are getting in so yes we actually have to accept that we might just lost the game but it's okay, as I said, we're just accepting that Mighty Miner is getting in against him. So maybe they're coming barbarians using the ability. So can I actually activate the king or push? No, I can't. Even, yes, bearing my troops onto the tower. Fireball is coming. Tombstone is coming in also. So just the one piggy is taking some damage onto us. But the mirrored piggies are actually taking us down so we lost the last game unfortunately but i just knew it before playing against him because hunter the firecracker and also the mirror is just too much for us personally and especially because of of our own mighty miner which is just just bad against him anyways i still hoped you like this kind of content for sure because of the last game we are not pushing that much trophies or it's it's normal playing so many games in the top later than losing one game and just dropping out of the top 10 anyways thanks for watching also subscribe to this channel if you want to see more part of the road to 8000 trophies see you next video bye guys